Hello, this is Christian here. Welcome to Ride to Dream Robotics series. For this particular episode, we'll be building the Explorer. Now, to begin building, we need to familiarize yourself with some of the building pieces. We've selected all the pieces that we need for this particular build, and that is what is right in front of me. Let's look at this piece. This is called the beams. There are different length of these pieces. This is the maximum length you'd find in the EV3, and I, and I think even in the Lego Technique, this is the longest. The length of this is 15. How do you count that? Now, you just count the number of holes in it, and if you count these holes, you get up to 15. There are shorter ones, like for example, this. Let's count this and see how, many, how long this is. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. So this is an 11 length piece. So for this build, we have four or 15 uh, length beams. We have axles. Now let's look at the length of an axle. So this is a three length axle. How do you know it's three length? You just pick any of these beams, put it next to it, and then count the number of holes that it covers. So if you count this, you see one, two, three. So this axle is three length. There are other longer axles like this, which is a five length axle. So you just put it next to it and count the number of holes. It's one, two, three, four, five. So that's how you know the length of an axle. And then these are your regular pins. You can think of these pins as nails, as a carpenter would use nails. We normally use them to join two pieces or more together. Okay, so let's begin our build. This will take some time, so it will be sped up for you to have a look at it. You can slow it down or you can just look at the build guide which we'll share. All right, that's it. So we have our first robot built. This is the first robot we ever built in my class when I began robotics uh, about seven years ago. And um, we've kind of stuck to this robot. This is really easy to build. It will take you about um, 20 minutes, 20 to 30 minutes, depending on how uh, used to you are with Lego. If you've been building with Lego before this, you should be able to build this in about 15 minutes following the instructions. So it's really easy to build, and it pretty much does everything we want to do, especially for a beginner. And this is the robot that we'll be using to learn how to work with the various sensors that come in the kit. Uh, in the future, as we advance, we'll build different types of robots that have different capabilities. But this robot is really good for learning the basics. So if you have any comments or suggestions, or you built this before and you think you could do it better or miss something out, just leave it in the comments and uh, I'll get back to you. Thanks for watching and make sure to follow, subscribe and see you in the next episode.